Hello, YouTube. My name's Karen. I'm 28 years old, and I currently live in the Oakland Bay Area in California. And this will be my first TTC vlog. Um, I thought this would be a good way to kind of get feedback and any type of information that I possibly can from you women out there that are trying to conceive or have conceived and what your um, what you did to help you get pregnant. Um, a little background story. Uh, I've been married to a wonderful man for the past year and a couple months um, to my husband since October 16, 2010. Um, a few months after that, we decided that it would probably be a good idea for me to get off birth control. Um, I was on it for 10 years, so I kind of thought I needed to get that you know, clean out of my system um, so that I can hopefully try. Um, back in 2009, I had actually gotten um, another procedure done. Um, in Canada, we call it LEAP. I'm originally from Canada. Um, we call it a LEAP. Um, and it has to do with your abnormal cells. So you get um, kind of a layer of skin, I think, taken off your cervix. So I was worried that that would be a problem. My doctor reassured me that it's not. The only problem that you would have is that you would have a shortened cervix, but it wouldn't hinder you getting pregnant. Good to know. So. Me and my husband moved here from um, the Toronto area in Canada um, in July. So we decided to kind of put everything on a hold um, leading up to that time because we knew that it was going to happen and we didn't really want to put any more stress on me or our relationship. So once August came, we were here, we were settled, everything was good. We kind of started to try again and try to be a little bit more aggressive um, towards trying to conceive. No help whatsoever. Um, September was obviously not a good month, and um, October wasn't. But in the month of October, I had a friend tell me that she had tried um, this stuff called pre-seed. And, um, sorry, my dog has to get into the camera for some reason. I don't know what's wrong. Um, so she told me about this stuff called pre-seed, and I thought it, you know, anything will help you know and it, it's a personal lubricant that helps the sperm swim a little bit faster or just helps it along I guess so I got it for this month uh, I'm now on cycle day 19 or 20 um, and I'm pretty sure that I ovulated on the 15th of this month so I'm only three days DPO so um, I kind of figured this would probably be a good way for me to be able to track all of that and to get people's feedback on what they do. Um, I haven't really done much besides the pre-seed. Um, I've sort of tried to um, do the whole checking your cervix and kind of seeing if it's soft, if it's firm, a cervical mucus. I'm pretty sure I did ovulate on the 15th. I did feel a little bit of um, tingling kind of light cramps on the left hand side so I thought that was good because there's been a few months when I've actually haven't felt that at all um, so this month has been the first month that we've actually strongly strongly tried so I'm hoping that this will be the month um, if not then I will continue with my TTC videos um, if I do get pregnant then I will cons uh, start continuing with or start uh, pregnancy blogs. Um, since I don't live near my family, I thought that this would be a great way for them just to see, you know, what's going on, how my life is, um, especially during this type of time um, that me and my husband are going through. So, um, any feedback that any of you guys have on getting pregnant, having trouble conceiving, anything would be great. I've only really been actively trying for the last four months, so I wouldn't really think that I was someone that's been trying for years but as we all know us that are trying to get pregnant we want it to happen now um, and I feel like the only people that could really understand is people that have been through it um, just to try to get some feedback so if you guys can leave comments I, my channel isn't very big I don't have you know a lot of videos up this will be my first video on YouTube period so um, but you know, I would, I really want to get out there and see what people have gone through and um, how they overcome their challenges when it comes to trying to conceive. So, 
Um, I'll be back in a couple weeks to let you guys know um, if I got a positive um, or pregnancy test or not or what's going on from that point on. So take care guys and we'll talk soon.